Nick, tell me, uh, leading the team in tackles right now, what's that tell you? Are you happy with that? Um, yeah, I'm happy with it. I mean, but it's that's something it's a stat that, like, I mean, the biggest thing is defense of holes, getting the getting the win. So that's probably the biggest step. I mean, it's a good stat to have. I mean, I want to keep keep doing that. But I mean, like I said, I mean, the biggest thing is how the defense plays and how the team plays. Obviously, like getting back on the quarterback. This guy is no arm tackling with this guy coming up this week, right? Right. I mean, he's just. I mean, we play quarterbacks like running backs, and they can run. I mean, but this one, I mean, just you gotta get downhill, and kind of deliver a blow, and wrap up. And again, I mean, you have to get all those guys in the ball. Last week was that the hottest game you ever played in October? Um, yeah, that I can remember. I mean, that was I mean, it was brutal. Uh, just we knew it was gonna be hot. I mean, just being on the turf though kind of added just a little bit more heat. Um, but I mean, we did a good job of kind of rotating people and sidelines, just staying hydrated. You were around when the schedule wasn't like like what it is right now. Uh, do you like this better, week in, week out, like a playoff? Um, yeah, I do. It kind of keeps everyone kind of at their high. You have to be at your highest performance. So I mean, every week's a new challenge. I mean, there's no off weeks. I mean, as soon as one you win one game, play one game, you get back in the next day and focus on the next week. There's no, there's no weeks off. No 100 degree heat on the turf out there this week, but it's going to be a packed crowd, national TV. You got to be looking forward to it. Oh, I mean, I can't wait. I mean, anytime. I mean, I, I love every game. Here, so, I mean, just, yeah. so I mean, just to have college games in here in the national stage, I mean, it's going to be a great game. Thanks. This get old playing on uh, top. Total offenses, scoring offenses, this will be your second time in three weeks. Um, it, I mean, it doesn't get old. I mean, it kind of, like I said, it keeps us on our toes. Uh, I mean, but I love, I love the challenge. Uh, just, I mean, as a team, we love the challenge. I mean, we, we like to come in, have, have top ranked teams come in and play. I mean, especially coming, coming, having them come here. I mean, it's a good feeling. I guess it seems like TCU scores a different kind of way than Baylor does. They kind of use their defense to get get them in good field position. What have you seen? You know what this TCU team does to score. Um, they're dangerous, I and mean, that's probably the biggest thing is that I saw. Um, they like to attack different ways. I mean, their quarterback. I mean, he's, he can attack different ways, multiple threat. Um, I mean, they just they have athletes, they have weapons all on offense. Uh, so I mean, we're gonna have to be on our toes and just just play the best way to do it. Their running game has been talked about quite a bit. Catalan is one guy who can break it at any given time. Um, going up against the you know running backs you guys got here, I mean, does that you know prepare you for something like this? Oh yeah, I mean, just the depth we have here at running back. I mean, we're facing that every day. So I mean, <laughs> it's just, I mean, they're all. Yeah, it gives us a great look, put it that way. Uh, so, I mean, just people coming in, opponents. Uh, I mean, they're, all, they're great players, too, so we have to watch out for them. But, I mean, it does, it does help us prepare. What, um, just tell me tell me why this defense has, has gotten to this point now. And I know Tony obviously has a lot to do with it, but is it a, just a simply a confidence thing? Or, you know, why why is it that you guys have been able to, you know, hold some pretty good offenses, you know, down for quite a while? Um, um, I would say it's probably just a mentality thing. I mean, Coach Gibson, I mean, he's got us there. Just trying to be just just relentless. Trying to get up the field, be relentless with the ball. Um, just creating a harsh situation for, uh, for their offense to put them in. And uh, just, just trying to finish the game out strong. I mean, no, just not taking plays off, not taking drives off. Just our goal is to get out there and get the ball back to our offense. Is there something about going against these top offenses? I mean, another number one offense that you're facing now that, that brings out the best in you guys? Um, I mean, it helps us. I mean, I guess it helps to prepare a little bit harder, a little bit just kind of, I don't know, it's hard to say, but I'd say yes, it does. Um, just kind of the challenge. Just people like to prove people wrong, I guess. So, so I mean, we just try to, like I said, give them a feel and try to stop them. But I mean, the top offense come in. It kind of gives us this kind of little chip on our shoulder. People don't think we're gonna do it. So I mean, we gotta rise to the challenge. You get sick of it, or, or do you guys like having that challenge every single week? It seems like. Oh, uh, I mean, we like having the challenge. I mean, it's just like I said. I mean, it keeps us kind of at the peak of our performance.